Breathe in and listen with patient intention for the truth you didn't know you'd forgotten. I'll be your mirror. We witness together collective healing. Don't break in your panic, but this is urgent ceremony. Talk about decolonizing your mind. Learn how to do that. Get yourself a tree, sit under a tree and learn how to listen to that. Listen to that. Thank the creator, so thank the creator, so thank the creator. Go Salish, and then the Stolo, Nafkatten, and then the Sequatten. Go Salish, Stolo, Nafkatten, and then the Sequatten. Those are the people that are going to be left to fight this battle. Those are the people that are going to be left to fight this battle. Those are the people that are going to be left to fight this battle, this battle, this battle. This battle. that our government has newly approved the Trans Mountain Expansion Project going forward. Going forward. Sunny ways, my friends. Sunny ways. Sunny ways. Sunny ways. Sunny ways. Sunny ways. One of the dumbest things you could do. I think there's hope for everyone. I just don't think there's hope for politicians. I know we could stop it again, it's just a matter of how long will it take for you. Lying about how you're gonna like respect the shit out of indigenous people. that the pipeline will have stopped in seven generations. They've actually tried to get me arrested three times so far. Pick a side. People need to band together. People need to not splinter. My people are tough and tired. A weight heavy that I hope our children never have to carry. My people hold space for community to heal from trauma together. My community protects land, protects water, protects each other. I see sweet decolonialism whispered into the ears of our youth. And a light that my grandmothers and grandfathers might not have ever imagined. My people are tough.
wisdom, love, respect, courage, honesty, humility, justice system, how many corporate executives, aka real criminals, have corrupted this court, how, how many innocent citizens, citizens have had their future shadows in these colonial laws, how many statements have fallen on deaf ears of the judge and the crown, how many of my friends and allies have a witness being prosecuted in this court, how many times does this have to repeat until true justice is served? How many of you are willing to heed the call of our matriarchs when the time comes to cross this pipeline again? Again. 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 As the people, we've been here for tens of thousands of years. We say since the beginning of time. We've been here occupying and using this land for thousands and thousands of years. So we are the environment. As the Bottom people, we've been here for tens of thousands of years. We say since the beginning of time. We've been here occupying and using this land for thousands and thousands of years. So we are the environment. So we are the environment. See the hungry ocean rise slow to swallow tired land. A colonial sickness has seeped itself throughout the roots of this country. Now the air is hard to breathe and trees burn in the dry heat sending smoke signals that only clear eyes can see. All my relations, we are in the midst of an apocalypse. A reckoning on the horizon. If you look, you can see the end and a beginning. Stand strong and grounded in prayer. Protect the sacred loudly and fight for a future where we find our way home the land to rebuild in a good way. Act now out of choice to protect the sacred or wait for this country to crumble beneath shaky feet. Decolonize, unravel this internal mess that so many of us have inherited. It clouds our eyes. If you're not scared, dig deeper. If you're frightened, harness that energy to create meaningful change. Look to community for support and solidarity. I've been told that our sun dance is every day. Wake up in a good way, show up where your spirit leads you and listen. Listen.
think more powerful law than the colonial laws are the natural laws and the laws of this land. The laws of this land. Natural laws and the laws of this land. And listen with patient intention for the truth you didn't know you'd forgotten.